It looks like someone who might be of some use has finally shown up. I was beginning to think that the world might end before that would happen. It's a pleasure to make your acquaintance, stranger. I am an exploratory rover bot called Bhakti. What is this? An AI? Why are you here? Oh, there are so many things I could tell you, and I would love to, but I'm afraid I'm most dreadfully low on fuel. And so I must ask you to consider my most unworthy plea before any explanations can be given. I think I know what you're gonna say. Yes, I could tell you are intelligent. It is just as you suspect. I hope that you might assist me in procuring fuel of the robot variety. Do you expect me to head out into this huge desert and hope I'll strike oil? Oil? I am a precision instrument. No, I need specific fuel from these locations. Near the Sundry Shop, in the Bandit Settlement. Beside the Adamantis Skeleton. Somewhere at the base of that lofty and once great lighthouse. Those are the only locations I have detected so far. However, there may be others yet that I am unaware of. I can have a look. How much do you need? Ah, uh, a worthy question. I think about three inertia worth should get me by long enough. I am depending on your assistance. I need that fuel to save my comrades as soon as I possibly can. There are more of you? Yes, and I expect my comrades are most eagerly awaiting me. And now you should feel an emotional responsibility to help me, should you not? I'm so glad that we could bond like this. That is some programming you have. It seems that robots like that Bhakti were used by the bandits to help map out the ruins once. I'm surprised that any of the bots are still functioning. It certainly looked its age, but it carried on a conversation fine enough. Someone did a good job. Thank you very much. Ah, uh, I feel so lubricated once again. Though, hmm, my bearings do creak quite a bit after so long without servicing. But I suppose I am just a robot. A few creaks are only natural. I do envy you humans, who do not need regular maintenance. Maintenance? No. But we do get hurt, and then we need rest and care if we want to get better. Yes, but the humans these days do not age nor die, compared to a robot that will never get better if it breaks down. Yours is a life of infinite chances. Well, now you have a chance of your own. So what about those friends of yours who need saving? They are just this way. Follow me. functions. Everyone, I do apologize for your long wait. You must have been quite troubled by being trapped in here for such a long time. Do not worry. You are free now to leave. There does not appear to be a response. Do you suppose they are sleeping? Are your friends out of fuel too? If they're like you, then they'll just need their tanks filled to be up and running again. I'm afraid they would have little use for such fuel. They are humans, after all. What did you say? We've been trapped for some time now. 
There's no food or water left. It looks like this is the end for us at last. If you're reading this, I hope you'll respect the wishes of the dead. Take our remains and give us a decent burial. Oh, and one other thing. I imagine you found a robot on the other side of this wall. If it stopped working, please bury it together with us. If it's still moving though, please fix it up and find it a new home. We may look like fools for worrying about an old robot in our last moments, but Bhakti is not just a robot. He has always been our greatest ally, companion, and friend. My goodness! Everyone looks quite different than I seem to recall. Why have you become so thin? Did the many long years spent in this dry desert air absorb the moisture from your bodies? These people... My friends, they do not seem to be able to start up. If they have broken down, I will need to obtain new parts and repair them. Bhakti, you can't repair a human like that. They're just... gone. When humans die, they never wake up again. Never start up again? But we are finally reunited after so long. I rationed my fuel so carefully, all in an effort to witness the end of the world together with them, my dear friends. I had no idea that they needed constant refueling. They must have thought that I had abandoned them here. I don't think they did. They would have known that you were doing everything you could to save them. I'm sure they were grateful for that. I thank you. Humans are a kind species. I truly did love these human companions of mine. Farewell, my friends. Bhakti, you were the best friend these people could have hoped for. The light of these souls, they are the proof of how grateful your friends were.